this next step is called a half pivot turn. Okay? So we've done some quarter turns in the past. It's really just the same thing, only we're making a bigger turn. You're going to step forward to do the right side. You're going to step forward on your right, okay? all the way to the right foot. Now I'm going to rotate my body a half turn to the left and bring the weight forward onto the left foot. Okay? So it's a little hard to do slow, but you step out and turn. You'll notice that I'm not picking up my foot in any way at all. I'm pretending that they're anchored to the floor and I'm just rotating around, but I want to make sure that I change that weight. So my weight's on my right as I rotate my weights on my left, okay? If I was doing it on the left side, same thing, I'd step forward onto the left, I would turn shifting my weight to the right, halfway around. How do you know where halfway is? It's the wall that's gonna be on your back, okay? So I'm gonna step here and go to there. With the left foot, I would step here and go to there, all right? Um, you're gonna see a lot of those. You're gonna see a lot of those sometimes repeated, all right? So we're gonna step forward on the right, do the step half turn, leaving the left there, step forward on the right, and step half turn again, okay? So we end up making a full turn around, going one, two, three, four. If you were ever in the military or the marching band, these are called about faces as well. So it would be step about face and step about the face. If we were using the left to do a double one, which is a little less frequent, it would be step, turn, step, turn. Okay, these are usually single counts, so it would be one, two, three, four. The other side would be one, two, three, four. Okay, or just a single one, one, two. And those are your half pivot turns.